Uh, let's take you to Lad People Stadium for highlights of the 2010 Under Armour Senior Bowl. Lots of big names, Michael. Big showing up for the including that young man right there, Tim Tebow. First play of the game for the South Squad, and Tebow dumps off the screen to Dexter McCuster. Who picks up a first down, but it was a rough day for Tim Tebow overall. Yeah, you know, a lot of drops, wasn't ever in rhythm, and that that North defensive front caused a lot of problems. Uh, the third and six there, and Tebow couldn't find USC tight end Anthony McCoy. After a North field goal, this is the South's second possession. Tebow will uh, complete to Jeremy Williams for seven yards. But then four plays later on a third and seven, and his speed is not going to bail him out, especially in the next level, Chris. No, not at all. I, I, honestly, on this play right here, he looked like a, a very good H-back. I saw some Chris Julian. <laughs> Chris is changing honestly, his position. Honestly, I, I think that he'd be like, uh, I think he'll be a player. All He's right, the TCU's Daryl Washington got him there. Tony Fife comes in, starting at quarterback, and he hits his Cincinnati roommate, Marty Gilliard, who had a big day to the 28th, second quarter, same drive. It's LeGarrette Blunt. And what a season he had, being suspended for most of the way before uh, being reactivated. Gets in for the touchdown there. Big run for him. He needed to show people he could come back, and he was compliant with the rules. Right, Jared Brown in for quarterback at the South. Can't handle the snap there. Austin Lane recovers. Nobody really moving towards these live fumbles. Yeah, I don't think they understood the rules completely. I think they're a little confused on the pro game of rules. There's the man right there, Fran. There he is. Wow. Michigan defensive end Brandon Graham was all over the place. Gets to Jared Brown there. And on the next possession on a second and seven, stays home on the misdirection, which is what you want to see from the young guys are keeping their spot. Oh, absolutely. I mean, he, he showed himself today. I think he's going to definitely be high in the draft, and he has a lot of good things coming up. Lamar Woodley reminds you of him, doesn't he? Oh, absolutely. Wraps up USC Stephon Johnson. All right, uh, Sean Canfield looking in the end zone, but he's picked off by USC's Taylor Mays. Mays, one of the high-profile kids in this game. Great job reading the route, read the quarterback's eyes all the way, played the ball perfectly. That's a nice play. That's what you're looking for from your safety. And how about Zach Robinson from Oklahoma State came in here and operated the two-minute drill to perfection, yeah, Michael. Absolutely. You know, he loses Des Bryant, one of the best receivers in the draft, lost a lot of offensive players. It was good to see Zach Robinson lead him on this drive at the end of the half. And here he is to Colin Pete. Nice pass. Yeah. <laughs> you don't throw around <laughs> offensive compliments too easily, do you, Chris? No, not at all. Not at all. <laughs> he was three for five on that drive for 82 yards with Zach Robinson. The two-minute drill. Impressive. All right. Here comes Graham causing more havoc. And he knocks the ball out. That's what's so good. He's smart how to get the ball out. I'll tell you what, he's an impressive player. 34, 43 in. He, he really is impressive. Had a couple of sacks and a forced fumble. All right, to Tim Tebow. Back in the game here, hands it off to McCluster, who was drilled by Larry Asante, forcing a fumble. And there was just south of 10 fumbles yeah. in this football game. It was unbelievable. All right, to Dan Lefevre now from Central Michigan, looking for Gilliard. 43 yards. Gilliard, big play guy. Big you know, and makes the plays up the field. That's what he did at Cincinnati. Go ahead, big Look, man. I have an offensive compliment. Lefebvre played his tail off. Hey. Look at <laughs> and Chris Jenkins are looking for more here. Lefebvre rolling out to, to the right side, but uh, several defenders are wrapping him up. And so the ball goes over on downs. Next possession, though. And this is what you're talking about, Chris. Absolutely. I told you, he played. I'll give him uh, a guy uh, a compliment. I think that he was the uh, best the best quarterback today. Yeah, he played, and that receiver was the best receiver. He was explosive down the field. That's what he did at Cincinnati. Those are the kind of plays he made. 32 yards to Gillier, 31-13. Tim Tebow here is a hit by Cal's Tyson. Alu Alu and Tebow fumbles for the second time in the game. So he was 7-11 for 44 yards, but he had two fumbles. He only rushed for four yards. The North, the big 31 to 13 winner, and they were uh, powered uh, by some great defense, including Brandon Graham from Michigan, who had two sacks and a forced fumble. And Lefevre on this day uh, was the best quarterback on the field, throwing for 97 yards and that 32 yard touchdown strike to Marty Gilliard.